YouTube channel. It's me, Naomi Marie, and I'm back with another video. So today is going to be over this synthetic red unit that I am wearing on my head. I was kind of iffy, I'm not going to lie, because I'm not used to such bright colors on my skin. But this red is definitely popping. You know, this is like Riri vibes times 10. Like you know before we get to this youtube video be sure to subscribe to my youtube channel if you're not already subscribed if you're new to my channel welcome welcome i'm naomi marie i need to figure out what i'm gonna call y'all like i think i might just be basic and call y'all nay gang because low-key it does pop but as i was about to say if you guys would like to see how i style this wig and all that good stuff and the details be sure to keep watching so this was the packaging hair spells it's a nice silky packaging purple this fuchsia purple color is really pretty so inside i have a rihanna red 24 inch synthetic unit it also came wrapped in this purple bag and then inside of the other bag there were a pair of lashes and then there's a little coupon with their information how to take care of the wig how to contact them and all of that good stuff so just a big thank you for hair spells for partnering with me so i could put out this video for you guys y'all are probably wondering why i got a red unit I haven't done a red wig before so i was pretty curious to try it out and see how it would do so we'll just see um out of the package it also came in a hairnet a white hairnet so far from what i can see the wig looks pretty natural for a synthetic unit just the lacing would be really light in my opinion so i would have to go back and add some foundation this is all the room, the clips and the combs, and then you also get these little parts in the back that you can hook on. But the lace is a little bit too light for my liking. So I will end up going back with some foundation or like some um, powder that closely matches my skin color. I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. So I have my Maybelline Fit Me powder in the color Mocha. I'm gonna try this first and see if it works just because I don't really wanna apply foundation. So we're gonna apply some of this bad boy on there. Okay, we actually might be good. We'll just try it anyways. And if it doesn't work, you know, we can always go back on foundation. I just washed my hair and I just put it in these little quick braids so it's not all the way dry. I'm just gonna put a little bit of my powder on here. Just in case, if you see any of the lace on the wig, it won't be too noticeable. Because this cap is not my color, clearly. So, here we go. This is what I have right now. I'm going to go cut off the lace really quick. We're just going to put it back on and then style it that way. I haven't decided if I'm really going to glue it down yet, but depending on how I style it, I may have to glue it down just so it has like some stability. I really do wish that there was some combs in the back. This is what the wig is looking like. I'm just, like I said, gonna go glue it down for the sake of this video. And I will just walk you guys through the process of this. Hair clips me, please. So I have my got to be glue right here. I usually use the black one, but I bought the white one because I felt like I wasn't using it for a while. And then now I wish I really would have had the black one. It is what it is. You have to be careful with this one because it is like whiter. Whiter. Because it's so thick and it's a white consistency sometimes like it is seep through the lace and leave you looking a little bit ashy slash messy so you do want to be careful with this you can use a toothbrush q-tip whatever floats your boat i just use my finger mm. i'm gonna tie this on there for a few minutes but i just am super impatient right now first of all woo! 
When I'm trying to record a video, everything just wants to go wrong. Like I was finna say, I'm pretty sure that this is, this side's a little bit too long. So I'm just gonna go cut some of it off. My ties with my people, now my friend for the puzzle. Low key getting quite a bit of tangling with this unit. As I always say in every video that is a synthetic review, synthetic units tend to tangle more, but this one kind of came out a little bit tangly. I mean, it's not too bad, but. So now we're gonna do baby hairs because I like the lace hairline, but it's just too straight for me. So I'm gonna use my handy dandy, this brush, whatever you may call it. Everybody has a different name for it. You can find it at your local beauty supplier, probably for like a dollar. I'm gonna use this and I'm taking out a little bit of hair from the front. I like to work this in sections because sometimes I get a little overwhelmed when I have too many pieces of hair and then I end up forming too much baby hair. Baby hair should be very sudden as if it were your real hair. Even though clearly this ain't my real hair because it's red, but you know. <sighs> so... I'm just gonna diagonally cut that down like that. And I'm going to get my Eco Styler gel. And I'm going, y'all, this hair is sticking to my lip gloss. I'm going to take the hair and I'm going to swoop it in this direction. Ba boom. All right. Got my scissors again. All right. I just need to get my life together, y'all. Period. Okay, now I'm gonna do this side. Okay, y'all, so this is the finished product. So overall, I do love this color. It's so bright, so vibrant, and so like crisp and sharp. It's not like one of those dull reds, like a really bright red. Um, synthetic wig wise, it's pretty nice. I will say the ends, I've had like a lot of tangling before I even decided to put heat on it. In the beginning, it kind of came out of the package, you know, not too tangly, but tangly. Um, this wig comes in 24 and I believe 26 inches. But as I said, like I've experienced quite a bit tangling in this um unit i overall do like it the hairline was very natural it was easy to formulate baby hairs it didn't come with it so of course i had to cut it on my own um as far as shedding this is basically what i got out of it which is not bad but just know like if it does tangle you're going to be combing for a, a hot minute um you can also wear this style down it just depends on your preference i decided to put it up just be very careful if you do decide to put it up that you know this cap inside is like a beige so certain parts of it will show if it's not properly done 
but I can't see the back of my head, so if y'all see it, sorry, but I'll give y'all a quick spin. Uh huh. And um, but as I said, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And be sure to subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. I'll see y'all in my next video. Peace out.